Hazaranga National Park is a national park in the Golagat, Sonipur, and Nagang districts of the state of Assam, India. It is one of the most important wildlife sanctuaries in the world and is particularly famous for its population of one-horned rhinoceros. Two-thirds of the world's one-horned rhinoceroses live in Kazaranga. The Indian rhinoceros and their habitat were the primary targets of protection when Kazaranga National Park was first created as a reserve forest in 1905. Kazaranga National Park was established as a game reserve in 1916 and it later changed its status to a wildlife sanctuary in 1950. Kazaranga National Park was established as a national park on January 1, 1974. It received the UNESCO World Heritage Site designation in 1985. Following a decline in the tiger population, the Indian government authorized the creation of the Kazaranga Tiger Reserve in August 2006. Because Kazaranga is situated in the Brahmaputra Rover floodplain, the earth there is abundant in alluvial deposits. Small rivers run through the park from east to west and drain into the Brahmaputra River. The biggest secured area on the southern bank of the Brahmaputra River, Kazaranga National Park has a land area of 1030 km square. Kazaranga National Park is currently overseen by the Assam State Government's Environment Department. One-horned rhinoceros are among Kazaranga National Park's top draws. Aside from that, the major attractions of this national park are the Elephant Asiatic Water Buffalo and the Royal Bengal Tear. According to the 2018 census, Kazaranga National Park is home to 2,413 rhinoceros in total and roughly 1,100 elephants. Nine out of the 14 types of primates on the Indian subcontinent are found in Kazaranga National Park. The number of one-horned rhinos in Pabatora Wildlife Sanctuary is the highest in the entire globe. The second highest concentration of rhinos in Assam is found in Kazaranga National Park. There are about 35 different mammal species in Kazaranga National Park, and 15 of them are classified in Schedule 1 of the Wildlife Protection Act of 1972. With 103 tigers, Kazaranga National Park ranks third in India behind Jim Corbett and Bandipur National Park. 96 different kinds of wetland birds have been found in Kazaranga National Park. It ranks among the greatest totals for Indian wildlife reserves. Over time, the survey has noted a change in the types and numbers of birds. The northern pintail variety and the bar-headed goose both have significant shares. The park's bagori, koora, and burapahar have all been surveyed. The Eurasian widgeon, gadwall, little cormorant, northern lapwing, spot-billed pelican, and ruddy shell duck are additional species found in this area. You can find Indian gooseberries, cotton trees, tall eggplant grass, dece broadleaf woods, alluvial savanna woodlands, and marshlands here. There are countless smaller bodies of water in Kazaranga as well. Because of the frequent flooding, wetland areas, deciduous woods, and grasslands can also be seen. Floods play an important part in the maintenance of the Tiger Reserve's ecological system. The yearly feature of Kazaranga National Park is floods. Flooding promotes soil formation and silt deposition while also assisting in the upkeep of flora water bodies. Fish also use flood water as a breeding site. However, the annual flooding of the Brahmaputra River poses a significant challenge for the Kazaranga National Park. Due to the numerous water bodies in Kazaranga National Park, it floods annually when it rains non-stop. Because the powerful Brahmaputra passes through these regions, the eastern and northern portions of the park are the most impacted. One of the main problems during the summer rains is soil erosion. Another significant issue and danger to the Kazaranga National Park is the killing of rhinos by poachers. Another worrying issue is the expanding human populace near the park. The rapid urbanization of rhino habitats is problematic because it can result in several harmful activities, such as market contraction and farming expansion. Assam government headed by Chief Minister Himanta Biswa Sarma has taken many steps to safeguard this immensely important wildlife habitant land.